Well, it's it is a gumbo. That's how we kind of arrived at the name. Gumbo. Uh. The Nolans Gumbo Kings are a band consisting of world-renowned musicians, and they're based right here in North Texas. Founding member and trumpet player Steve Howard says the band takes different New Orleans musical styles and creates a gumbo, so to speak, of different sounds. And then the style that we play it in isn't the typical two-beat banjo kind of thing. It's a real hard swinging uh, uh, band uh, in terms of of, of what we do rhythmically and harmonically and everything else. The Gumbo Kings got their start in 2002 when Steve Howard met saxophone player Mike Sizer at a gig purely by chance, and they hit it off. And I loved it, and at the end of the session I said, you know, I've always loved New Orleans music and Dixieland music, and I never get a chance to play it. I said, we ought to try to get together a little group and just play some tunes sometimes. And he said, oh man, you're crazy. And, you know, I said, well, you know, it sounds like it'd be fun. So, and he said, well, it might be, but it'd be a lot of hassle. And he was kind of negative about it. Needless to say, the Gumbo Kings finally did get together with Steve Howard on trumpet, Mike Sizer on the sax and clarinet, Brad Herring on the trombone, Bobby Bro on drums, Carl Hillman on bass, and Brian Piper on piano. And then we said, hey, we ought to just find a little place to play. So we started playing over at the Duck Inn restaurant in Lake Dallas just on a Sunday night, just thinking we would just get together and play Dixieland songs. And so that's how it really kind of started, just as a bunch of guys wanting to get together and play music. The Gumbo Kings have recorded two CDs to date and play shows every chance they get. Our main goal is to have fun. And if the music, I think that's why the Gumbo Kings have been successful is that uh, we all, and people would tell us when they come here, they say, you guys just look like you're having so much fun. And the audience gets into it. And it's no secret to the audience that these guys can really play. The individual members of the Gumbo Kings have worked for world famous musicians such as Mel Torme, Dukes of Dixieland, Bernadette Peters, and Robert Goulet. Howard himself has played for Ray Charles, Dr. John, and at one time was even Paul McCartney's trumpet player. Yeah, that Paul McCartney. For five years, I did all of his major, all of his tours, and uh, most of his recordings that had horns on them, and then also uh, uh, films. I was in a lot of the films of the Wings. So I was in the Wings from 1975 to 1980, and all of, all of the world tours and everything and all that. So I, I did all that stuff. Howard's roots as a trumpet player began in the fourth grade, but he soon realized the instrument would be with him for the rest of his life. Had a trumpet teacher, uh, a fellow named Bob Lee, very fine trumpet player, and he was playing in the North Texas uh, one o'clock lab band. And I went up to a concert and heard the lab bands, and then I was hooked after that. I thought, oh man, this is the greatest thing, and this is what I want to do. And uh, so that sort of drove me down the road. And uh, at this point, there's sort of no turning back. It's already, I'm already committed to it, so there's nothing else I can do. It's been that way for a while. Howard may be committed to his craft, but like he said, the Gumbo Kings are more about having fun than making money. The guys definitely don't go home empty-handed, though. We have fun, and it does make us a little bit of money. We're not going to get rich or buy any new Cadillac or anything, but we're having a good time. The Gumbo Kings are working on a new Christmas album, continuing to play gigs like this year's Denton Arts and Jazz Festival, and most importantly, they're having fun wherever they go. It's always just a thrill, and we look forward to the gigs that we do, you know, so, and, and then when we're on the bandstand making music, we're having fun. And when the Nolans Gumbo Kings aren't bringing down the house with their unique sound, they do all have day jobs. Whatever you have to do, you know, that's my thing. I have a friend of mine that played trumpet with Frank Sinatra, and he's an accountant now, so. <laughs> Casey Claiborne, NT Scene.